Hey guys, it's Jen and welcome back to my channel. So recently a lot of you guys have been commenting on my video on how to get unlimited passes on episode and a lot of you guys have been saying that it isn't working for you. So in today's video I'm going to be sharing some tips so that you can make sure that this hack works and you can get those free passes. Also, if this is your first time watching my channel, my name is Jen and I make tons of episode videos every week. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on any new content. And last but not least, if you haven't seen my unlimited pass hack video, you should definitely go watch it. It's linked in the description down below so you can easily find it. Okay, so without further ado, let's just get started with the video. Okay, so tip number one is that you retry the hack multiple times because sometimes it doesn't work on the first try and you need to do it about four or five more times before it actually works. So what you just want to do is go into episode, see that you don't have any passes, go into your settings, like mentioned in my previous video, go to general, date and time, and then change the date from there. And keep on repeating that so many times so that you can make sure that the hack works. So by doing this lots of times, you can trick the app that you are in actually in a time that is ahead of time, so you can get your free passes instead of waiting four hours to get those four passes. Okay, so hack number two is that when you are in settings, you change not only the hours but also the minutes. So this was suggested by one of my subscribers and they said that even if you change the, um, the date, you should also be changing the minutes too. And this hack has worked for me lots of times, so you should definitely go try it out. Okay, so my hack number three is for all my international viewers because I know there are tons of you out there and that is by going into your settings and unclicking the box that says set automatically. So if you are living in a remote country um, that is not like the United States or Canada, I would suggest that you choose a time zone anywhere in the US or Canada. Let's just try New York, for example. And this will trick your device into thinking that it is in the US or in any region and that you will follow that time zone. And I'm not exactly sure why this works, but it has worked for me when I've been traveling and also a lot of my subscribers have also commented that down below in one of my videos and said that it worked for them. So you should definitely try that out. Okay, so hack number four is super important because if you don't do this, this hack will most likely not work. And that is after you've changed the time in your date and time settings, when you're going back into the app, you have to make sure that you double tap and clear, oops, sorry. You have to double tap and clear your history before the app opens. And that's really important because if you don't do that, the app will just load like normally and nothing will change. And I know you can do this in Apple devices by double tapping the screen, but you can also do this in Android devices, I'm pretty sure, by touching the left corner of the screen or something like that, that will um, clear your search history. Okay, so tip number five is that when you are changing your time in the settings, that you don't only change it by a couple hours or days, but you actually change it by an entire month. So what you want to do is just go to the, the column that has the day and just scroll very far if you're using an Apple device. And in this example, I scrolled all the way to November. And this can work sometimes. I've done it before and it's worked. So after I've just changed it by an entire month, I click on episode again, double tap to clear the history, and open it again and it should work. Okay, so my tip number six, this one isn't really a tip, but it's more of an explanation as to why it isn't working. And that's just because Episode is constantly updating their app and they're trying to fix all the bugs. Because Episode doesn't really want people to be changing the time to get free passes, they want you to actually buy the passes. So they're always trying to bypass this hack and they're trying to get it to not work. So like I mentioned before, you want to try it multiple times and try to hack the system so it will work. So since Episode is always changing their app and they're updating it to bypass these hacks, I cannot guarantee that these hacks will work every time, but using these tips, hopefully it will make it work more often and you can get those free passes when you don't want to wait those four hours and that it will work for you. Okay guys, that's it for my video. I hope it was helpful for you. If it was, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to comment down below what your favorite episode story is because I'm always looking for new stories. 
Also, I just wanted to point out that I have tons of cool episode videos that I'm planning for the future, so don't forget to hit that notification button so you will be notified as soon as I upload a video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video next week.